how do you turn ideas into earrings? Like Dallas designer Stephanie Ann launched her new jewelry line this spring and is now introducing her fall collection. But where do all those ideas come from and how do they end up into these beautiful pieces of jewelry? Well, Stephanie Ann is here. We're going to find out. How are you, Stephanie Hi, Ann? I'm so happy to be here. Good morning. Good morning. You're a big name here in North Texas. Your baubles are sold everywhere in Neiman, so congratulations for Thank that. You. Thank but you, you used to actually be a different type of designer. You designed children's I, furniture, interior yes. designs. How yes. did you parlay that into jewelry? Well, you know, 10, 15 years later, here I am doing jewelry. I started out designing baby cribs, and everybody thinks it's hilarious. Baby cribs? That was my, my forte, was the juvenile industry. Then I just kind of started changing my course, thinking, oh, I'm getting tired of the baby thing. I've been there and did that. Then I moved on into home decor, accessories, tables, etc. And I loved all of that. Then I started thinking, gosh, I'm really into fashion. <laughs> honestly, it's as my, as I matured, as I grew, as I changed, I had different interests. And now my interest for the last, really, it's been about two years, jewelry. And I started sketching, taking classes. It was a hobby. The hobby then, I would wear a piece of jewelry, I'd walk in an elevator, I would walk out with it sold. And it was hilarious. Yeah. It would be funny. I would say, I honey, my husband, I'd say, you're not going to believe it, but this lady wants to, to buy these. Should I Sell them to her. Right off of your he's wrist. Like, he's like, you'll make something else. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, tell it, your husband said. And that's how it started. This is kind of an inspiring story to anybody who's watching who's kind of thinking, I've got this creative knack and yes. I can kind of transcend this into what's happening in my life right now. And what was happening was fashion for you. And voila, we're really glad because we Love get it. to wear fun inspirations like this. Okay, take a look at this. This is kind of how it starts. You mm -hmm. actually sketch out, like you would a piece of furniture, a crib, I kind do. of your different ideas on these papers. And then you, voila, get pieces of jewelry. I mean, my main tool for design is this little graphic pad right here. I start with a blank slate. I have fun with this. I can visualize anything and I just start sketching it. And then they turn into, you know, something that becomes more scaled. Then I add color. Then I add stones. Then I add dimensions. And of course, I have all my stones cut the way I want them cut. So I have to understand the millimeters and the sizes and the and the weights and the gender Do you understand qualities. all of that? Do you understand the millimeters I do and the now. and the weights? I do now. You probably I do now. had to learn because you you know we're taking us viewers through the process where you have raw, a, raw materials mm -hmm. and a grid mm -hmm. and a paper and you just have to kind of sit there. It's a very solitary job I'm assuming you're by yourself. It's fabulous. Actually no. You know when I am designing I'm out in a park. I'm in a city. I'm in Europe. I'm in Mexico. Wherever I am I take this little guy and I start sketching from inspirations that I see. It could be a tree, it could be an iron gate. It is just so much fun for me because I see inspiration in everything. Okay. That's what's so fun. Lots of different raw materials, but take us on a tour on the table because yes. there's a whole lot of gold on this table. Is, I, is that what you're trending towards right now? Yes. You know, it's, it's so much fun to have the patina of the 24 karat gold. So for a price point right now, it looks like it's precious, precious gems, precious jewelry. But the price points are so wonderful. That is one reason why Neiman Marcus, for the designer jewelry department, they thought this is fabulous because this little pendant is fabulous. It's a uh, my ventana, and it's oh, just it comes right off. You just take off, switch everything. So when you're traveling, you've got this great little chain. My Stephanie and chains have been to die for. All of these are hand done. You can just add on. Oh my gosh! And then you've got this great look that's that's oh, wow. very, very um, so you, flexible. So you buy the chain you like. So maybe you like I like these little circles. I like these little ovals. You mix and match, and then you just buy the pendant that you want to wear. You can wear it as a long necklace. You can wear it as a choker. You can layer. Mm -hmm. This is very cool. I like this a lot, and I'm a little <laughs> mad that I didn't think of this myself. Are you thinking about that at home too, <laughs> Stephanie? Ann, way to go! A North Texas thank girl you, doing well, making so fabulous fun. jewelry. Come out to Fashion's Night Out. Yeah, Fashion's We've Night got Out. Neiman Marcus Willow Bend. Yes. My store, Stephanie Ann. Have you heard of this Fashion's Night Out? It's huge. Uh -huh. I'm hosting one. Everyone here is hosting one somewhere around the Metroplex. Well, it's a huge night. It's tomorrow. You're going to be at Neiman's, like you said, at Willow Bend, along with DJs, Chef Whitney oh. Miller from Master Chef. She's going to be on our show tomorrow, and even our own Ron and Cynthia are going to be out there too. So you can It'll get all excellent. the details on NeimanMarkets.com. Thanks, Stephanie Ann.